Here we are with Zelico Franulovic, tournament director in Monte Carlo. Ten years in a row as a tournament director. Uh, about how many? 45 years ago, or you were the champion of Monte Carlo. And uh, what are you expecting new this year? I mean, well, next year. I mean, the tournament will be played on between 9 and 17 April. Uh, Ubaldo, as every year, uh, given that we don't have a huge site, you know how Monte Carlo is, everything is small, <laughs> including uh, the country itself, it's not a big, big, big town or big city. So what we try to do in order to, to be able to follow the, the development of tennis, because the tennis in the last 10 years only is growing grown so much, and us being a little bit limited, we, we are try to work the quality of the event, including the, the players, how to receive the players, how to offer them the last square foot or inch that we have in the site, we dedicate to the players. So next year, you ask what, what will we do, what, what will be new on the site. Maybe you won't see it, but underneath where, where the players' uh, area is already, we are, we are building a 400 square meters of space. With 120 will be players' gym, gym. that is, will be adjacent to their area where they have a med medical uh, area, medical services in their own locker room. And then plus uh, there are the usually evenings uh, with the players' party, the, the VIP party, the gymings or whatever. Uh, it's Monaco. It's Monaco. Uh, <laughs> I, mean, I don't think we have to talk about that. There will be this year again a uh, launch party at one of the uh, famous uh, lounge bars at the uh, uh, near the beach we will start on Saturday with that and then every year we do different things this year you saw we did it on the yacht club uh, the, this little exhibition uh, between uh, Djokovic and Wawrinka and next year we just I think we will just confirm the, the parties that are usually part of the tournament as, uh, as the one very famous uh, uh, grand of tennis, big, big gala of tennis, and the players' party, which is unique on the tour. There's no one, no, no tournament that players co cooperate and they do their own show. Yeah. And uh, look, uh, uh, Rafa Nadal won this tournament so many times that we thought it was infinite, you know. And then suddenly Djokovic came, I mean, the Pavrinka first, and then Djokovic, no? I mean, so yeah, but, what, what, but, what, what is going to happen now? Do you think Nadal is still competitive? Valdo, to win a, a tournament, not a Masters Series, yeah. eight times in a row, I think that's a record already itself. So now, if, if somebody else comes and wins it once or twice, as Novak Djokovic. did, Djokovic did, <laughs> it's not without a reason. In, in the meantime, Djokovic became number one the last three or four years, and, uh, and you, 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 you're following him, what, what is he doing this year, three out of four Grand Slam. So it's not a surprise that uh, Rafa, after eight years, lost the title in Monaco. He lost a few after that because maybe his form kind of, you know, was playing a little, little less, uh, less intensive, was injured, and then the other players came, came up. Uh, but I'm not worried about Rafa. As long as he's healthy, I mean, he's strong enough in his head and in his body, he will come back. And I'm sure you're not worried about the participation. All the best players will come. No, 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 no we're not worried about it. We are worried about injuries. But luckily, we are at the beginning of the year and there are less injuries. I mean, you following tell you see that after the US Open already, the players are yeah. kind of getting a little bit tired or injured. And that's, that's our luck, that's our advantage, that it's, it's a spring and the players are, are eager to play, they need to play, and they, you know, they like to win the tournament. Okay, and the ubitennis.com uh, likes to be at the tournament uh, and follow the, your event and uh, promote the event around the world. You are always most welcome, and ubitennis. Ciao. Ciao. Thanks.